Holy 2,000 damage. No, it's 3,000! <laughs> Nothing like some good old Isaac to start your day. Uh, we don't need daddy long legs. I might be able to abuse this. <laughs> Hold on, wait a second. Wait just a damn second. I have an idea. Now, I don't know if this is gonna work for me, but I need a roll. If I can get a roll, then I can uh, make use of this idea. I got a secret room too, which helps. Okay, alright, okay, yeah, no, I'm liable, liable. I think I can hold off, I don't, I don't need it, right? What I'm looking for is at least five rooms, but I don't think that's happening. Well, maybe with the big room it is. Oh my lord. This might just work out for me. How am I gonna get the pickups, you may ask? I'm gonna blow up my donor machine, that's how. And we'll see if this works out. Probably won't. Most definitely not. But it would be godlike if I did do it, dude, because that means that I, I played perfectly to get this to work. So, here's what we do. Obviously, I really want the humbling bundle, but we can't. I need at least eight pickups on the ground for bag of crafting to do its thing. Also, three cents equals a reroll, so I gotta keep that in mind as well. Let's take this and start bag of crafting. You need at least eight thingies, so I have three here. I'll see if I can get enough. Place it in here and grab another one. Perfect, one, two, three, four, five, six. That's six over there, I don't think we can do that. Place this one here. So you want you come in a secret room, reroll by battery, reroll. Maybe I get something good. I don't know. Vanishing twin, but it's golden. <laughs> Not what I was expecting. Uh, I don't really need it. Thanks though. I, double vanishing twin does sound kind of doofy though. And no, oh! no, 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 no. That's actually the craziest first floor I've had. Holy actual moly what did i just do that was pure skill rig i actually just used my gonga brain i was like hold on i see something here bag of crafting is riggable and i put it to use try not to get hit here okay so we have sacred orb uh and not only sacred orb we have freaking rock bottom dude what is that how do i want to use this i got no clue let's try our best to do something maybe with angel rooms just oh okay there goes the devil dum dum just because i feel like if you're gonna have rock bottom you want to go to angels more often I feel like they have more stat-enhancing items, right? you know, like Star of Bethlehem and Purity and such. Rather, as uh, Devil Rims just kind of break you with uh, tier effects. The latter is the opposite for angels, in my experience. Pills moments. Luck down. Okay. Balls. Yes! There's a perfectly timed key. Uh, I'm not gonna go in the Devil, so I'll use a reroll in here. What is that? That's a new one. Turn enemies into the current room into items, pickups, or nothing. Each time use increases the risk. Huh. Using it in an empty room will consume pickups. Well, I think that would be cool if I didn't have a D6. What about now? Dark Bum. We'll try and roll that, but if not, that's not bad to take. That sounds like a really cool item. I might uh, take use of that sometime. Alright, done for. I actually didn't get a deal. I'll take the speed ball and we'll go to the downpour. 1-3 spun is good. Okay, I'll go straight to the curse room. I'm okay with it. Sack altar. Don't get hit by these bulbs. That's the last thing you want. Uh, I'll try my best to roll that because that's in the curse room pool. Anything? Yeah, you know, I'll just take that. That's good. I got a key. I want to open that golden chest so bad, but I won't. I'll save it for something else. Worm friend is okay, uh, but luckily there were bulbs in there, meaning that I could actually potentially reroll this room. So give me a second and instead we'll fight the boss and come back. Rainmaker done for. Good item? Decent. I'll take it. I'll roll the angel. Sorry, what am I talking about? I'll roll the treasure room. Boom. Nah. Eh. That's okay. Maybe I should go to the shop now that I have bombs for the donation machine if need be. Oh my god, hold on please. Oh no, please god, please just give me this. I actually need it. There's literally a school bag in there. Wait, I'm on the mirror dom- I got so much more to do! Alright, Rainmaker is done for. Unfortunately, I got hit by the bulb, so I don't exactly have another roll like we were planning, but it's okay. It's not a big deal. Didn't really want to roll anything other way. I forgot to buy you! Okay. Well, I don't think I'm gonna get a double roll here, so I think I'll just hold off. Take whatever's in here. Oh, there you go. Cool. That turns into lovers. We can maybe abuse that. Larynx? I want to roll. I'm doing it. I don't care. Explosivo's fine. I'll do that. 
at least a roll for the angel. Actually, I hope I don't spawn the angel. I just realized I have no bombs. I don't want to do it, please. Don't spawn it. Don't you dare. I will be furious. Don't do it. Okay. <laughs> Alright, as squeezy is good. We'll take that. Okay, now I really need pickups, game. Come in here, we get prayer card, which is not incredible. However, I do have access to a restock machine. Sun card's cool. We can blow this dude up, basically guaranteeing us that good old angel. 54%. You're gonna teleport me? Of course you are. Oh my god, that's so much stuff. Okay, I'm gonna get a roll here by defeating this. This could be a big turning point. With Sacred Orb, this could be fat. Alright, I also have to remember I have Rock Bottom, which has literally seen no use the entire run. And I swear that's not even my fault this time. I just have not had any stats. Come on. Roll. Oh! That's perfect. Boom. And then boom. Oh my god. There you go. That's the turning point. That was the play we needed to make. Uh, Angel room item. Wow. Okay. I guess I might as well get the key pieces at this point, right? I'm sorry, I pressed a button and gave me proptosis? What is that? Why would you give me prop? Okay, I'm not even gonna take the key pieces then. There's three pedestals in here. I'm gonna use this as the reroll. We'll take this rotten heart, and then actually, it might be smart for me to get hit. I shouldn't have taken that rotten heart. I should get hit on the boss and on the floor and lower my deal chance even more. Uh, we definitely don't need car battery and mama mega. There's also a rainbow poop, just in case. It's only Depth's one. Then we'll get hit by you. Goodbye, Gate. Now, I shouldn't get a deal here. I mean, obviously there's a chance, but it'd be insane if I got it. Nice. Damage and range is perfect for me. Clear up this floor. I might get another roll. It's dependent. We'll see. And don't forget about the treasure room with the restock. Boom. Obviously, Proptosis was good. I don't really need it. These are all good, actually. This would get rid of my homing. This is decent, and that's a tears up. Is it bad that I want to roll more? I don't know. It's like, yeah, those are decent. But what about more? I feel like I'm being extra greedy for no reason. But I, I'm, I'm just going to do it. I don't care. Oh my god, that was so worth it. Every single one of these. Literally every single one. Rune bag, everything, everything, everything. Wow. Nice. Now let's go handle the... God, that synergy is so worth it. Uh, the treasure room. I don't need that. Sagittarius is actually pretty good. Considering I have foaming. Yeah, yeah, I'll take it. And then we will take the judgment with me and try and rig with that in the future. Okay, wow. Uh, needless to say, I'm quite happy with the way things turned out. In fact, maybe I should just try and rig now while there's a charge beggar here. This could be dumb. It might not. He might just be a demon beggar. Okay, you know what? I'm doing it. I need you to pay out as soon as possible, please. Perfect. Now I need to get as much charges as possible. Yeah. Oh my god. I'll do it. I'll do it. There's no situation where I don't do that. Let's be real. Try not to get hit because now I have a 100% deal chance. Thanks to that good old Andrew room play I did earlier. Uh, there's a tainted treasure room there. I kind of want to know. It's echo chamber. What? Huh? Echo chamber. Hello? That is sure. Whatever. I'll take it. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you're supposed to give me a tainted item, but there's probably a mechanic I don't know about. If you're just gonna give me echo chamber, I'll take it. All right, visage, you uh, you, you need to leave. It's not working out for you. Actually, it doesn't matter if I go angels anymore. I got chaos, dude. I'll probably just take pentagram. Roll this. Oh yeah, sure. We can start working towards our conjoined progress. Ooh, yeah, I'll take this. I'll take that. That was good. The other one was just an item I already have. I was thinking for uh, conjoined. And I think we'll go. Oh my god, I got a solo Isaac. Alright, how about this one? Oh my god, that's a good item. And I need another key, actually. Realizing I'm broke on keys. What I'm realizing is that for some reason, randomly today, the game just doesn't want to give me pickups. Like, today's the, today's the day. Like, uh, every single other time, I give you a pickup exactly when you want it. Oh my god, there's a Yera. But not today. What if I used the Yera right now and then took the Isaac with me and kept that locked in all the way until the chest? Basically meaning that I have uh, three Yeras with me. Would this not be the optimal play? Let's use Yera here and then take this soul of Isaac and then I'm assuming Yera's locked in with Echo Chamber right now. And I'm going to break. I could be wrong. Uh, it's not like I haven't broken the game already though, so it's just kind of extra. 
I, you know, I'm, I'm realizing I need keys. That sounds so dumb of me to say right now, but I really need keys if I'm gonna do this with the chest. At least we know we have four. Very minimum, we have four. But we are honestly gonna need so much more than just four. Logically, we need like 32 or something, right? Or I guess like 16. We're gonna need a lot. Perfect, another key. Okay, I, I have a plan. I have a plan of action. Leave first, find a room with an enemy, and let's recharge D1. Let's drop Soul of Isaac down here and D1 it, just because whatever, right? And we'll use this Soul of Cain to not only open Mega Satan, which is funny, but proc Yera. I need to do this a couple more times. Uh, there's a Mega Chest, I can't do that, sorry. Do this again. And now we can use... Wait. No, I think we need to do it one more time and then start using Soul of Isaac. Yara one last time. Perfect! Now, we start opening. Oh my god, there's a Crooked Penny. I actually don't have enough. That's crazy. I really don't have enough- Oh my god. I'll take Deadeye definitely for sure. Maybe I can like, blow some out. Wow. I don't have enough. Um, we'll take Lusty Blood because we have rock bottom damage. The rest of these I don't care about too much. Oh, there's a crooked penny! I so badly want to do it! But I already have such a good thing going that I should not. We'll roll it. There's Mantle and a lot of breakfast, but nothing too good. Actually, this is a straight damage up. Uh, and then let's farm our D1. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna dupe this D1. Oh my god, it's gonna copy Soul of Eden. We're gonna use Soul of Isaac in here. Uh, Succubus, I see. So, oh, little Sacred Heart. Take that. Our damage is increasing as we speak. Take Soul of Eden. And now I need another, another roll. So let's look for that. Using every nerve in my brain right now to make sure that this is the god roll. And I'm making sure that I'm doing this in the correct order. Don't need any of these. Roll again. MAGA MUSHROOM! There's a plain old damage here. Let's we'll take that Mega Mushroom a bit later. Let's D1 this just because we need something to do. And then I think I'm gonna be done with the D1 for now. And we're gonna switch it out for Mega Mush. And then we're gonna Soul of Eden. Okay, I think I did- Oh my god, there's a Diplo. I'm not gonna question why, I don't know. I th oh, you know what? I know why. It's because of uh, Soul of Eden. I switched it up. That's a Star of Bethlehem. That's a fat damage up. We take this. I'm trying to touch it while Succubus comes over here. Uh, I think I was too late. Diplo? Okay! Oh my god, what is going on, dude? I mean, this is just a damage up. I'm okay walking in here to touch it. Oh my- Oh! I have a new problem, which is I don't have full red hearts. Meaning my crown of light will not proc. So I have to keep that in mind. Is there anything else I need to do here? Any way to gain hearts? Any way to get basic damage going? I mean... Abaddon's a decent damage up, I'll take it, why not? I have Mega Mushroom in hand. Roll. There's an Incubus, there's a Lost Soul, there's a lot of damage ups. There's a Spin Down! Not to my knowledge, is there anything crazy that spins here? Oh my god, there's a Diplo. You're unironically kidding me. Hold the phone. Take this, I'll take the damage up, whatever. You're- you're joking, right? I need- I need to do something. I need to get an active item somewhere else on the floor. So I can switch out my spin down properly. I'm gonna drop a heart, blue baby. Oh, okay, 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 okay. It's it's happening, it's happening, it's happening. Perfect. He dropped one red heart, meaning I can go over here and get my crown of light going. Which actually gave me a fat damage up without me even activating everything. So this is gonna go really crazy. Now here's my problem. I don't have any way to really spin down here. I want that Diplopia. Diplopia wouldn't do anything. Okay, I think while Diplo would be cool, I don't see myself doing that. So I'm actually, I'm gonna do this. Just because there's batteries still on the ground and I can do more here. There's a C-section, uh, there's a couple damage ups, but they're like, whatever. Take this as a damage up. We obviously could take C-section, but I think I'd rather just roll here or maybe something more. Oh! And okay, listen, listen, at the very end, Obviously, I'm gonna want to do the Crooked Penny. We have one more roll left, but I don't even care. I I will do it. Whatever. Okay, you guys get the you guys get the 50/50. Boom. Oh! I get another one. Oh my God! There's Polly and triple shot and everything I have ever wanted. 
There's also an Ipecac, which is a damage up, I think. At this rate, I don't even know. Triple shot. There's a dog tooth. I don't have any more rolls, so we're just gonna take all of these. I think I just... Wait, do I still have the Soul of Isaac ready, or...? I think I used it wrong. Oh no, I do. I Of course I do. Why would I not? Oh my god. There's a Hamo. There's a Death Scythe. Okay. Alright. Yoink. I could void everything. <laughs> There's like four items in this one chest area. Kind of down to void everything, to be honest with you. I have a couple more chests I can open here. With this one bomb. I'm at 400 damage, holy moly. And then I guess I'll use another... I, I don't think I have another Soul of Eden in play, but I might as well try. See if I have. I do. Why do I have so many Soul of Edens? I just, I don't get it. Uh, this one was kind of ass though, to be honest with you. You know what? It's actually not that ass as an Eternal D6. I know there's a soy milk there, but I'm looking for only pure damage. Uh, wow. Okay. A lot got deleted, but I did find a D Infinity. Roll again. Satanic, Play-Doh, Ghost Pepper. I think that'll probably be it. I don't see myself doing any more here. This was the longest rate I've done in a very long time. Oh, there's a couple chests. Uh, okay, yeah, we definitely don't have- oh my god. Any more rolls. Oh my god, I'm exploding. No. No! I can't lose my crown of light. Why do I not have crown of light? Oh, I do. Okay. And something's about to happen. I think I'm gonna break 1000. I hope I do. It's been a while since I broke 1000. I need them to be in the same thing. Here we go. As soon as Succubus and Sarbethum are in the same area, I'm doing it. Oh my god, I did it. Holy 2000 damage! No, it's 3,000! What is my screen? What is going on, dude? 6,000! I think my PC is exploding. Maybe Lusty Blood procced? Oh, you know what? Dead Eye probably procced. I think the only thing I'm missing is Eve's Mascara, which would put me at 10k. Uh, I think you're done for. I can't even see my He literally died in one frame. That was unironically literally one frame. Do I fight Delirium with this? Knowing me, probably not. It would be funny if I did though. Uh, it looks like I am. I can't tell. I'm just a giant blob. I can. Move, please. Let's go. I think it's just that simple, really. I can't, I can't even move. I'm gonna hope that me walking in rooms is enough for me to just like live. Clear the room. I can't even move. I'm too powerful. There, I'm, just, I'm not gonna shoot anymore. I think it literally breaks my game too much. Alright, walk in, don't touch anything. They'll probably die. There go all my spiders to that one invulnerable dude. If worse ever comes to worse, I do have a Mega Mushroom I could just do. Uh, it lives, literally died to the 120 volt. <laughs> Feels good to have a run like this, honestly. It's been a long time coming. I've been trying to farm for a high damage run for like a good month now, so it's nice that it showed up. Also, I might as well pick up money because I have money equals power. Not like it really matters, but it might affect my damage in some way. You know what I could do at the very, very, very end? Uh, while we kill Delirium, I could try d 8 myself and see if I can get a better multiplier on my damage. My just natural multiplier. But after that, I think that's basically going to be the highest thing I could do. Because I don't have to use Mascara to carry me uh, through here. One tick from 120 volt and they're dead. I, I, it's so hilarious to me. Literally never seen that. It's on the level of like, oh, you point at them with finger and they die. Can't believe I went in every wrong direction, by the way. Look at this map. The heck? This is the largest void floor I have ever seen. It is so expansive. Shout out to Echo Chamber for completely destroying my game. By far the absolute reason why it happened, by the way. Like, easily. Without a shadow of a doubt, I basically had three Yeras and three Soul of Isaacs and three Soul of Edens. I could have became Guppy if I picked up that Guppy's head, but... I'm a little too lazy for that right now. I don't see ourselves getting anything more. So it's down here. I will pop Mega Mushroom. I will... Uh, he, he stomped and died. <laughs> that was the most anticlimactic. What the heck was that? D8? Oh, I got a fat range up. Okay, well, GG! I'm streaming Dead God right now, and we might even be doing something special where if you donate a video and make me laugh, I restart the entire run. See you there. Bye!